this go around we're going to be turning a uh, standard picture into uh, what I call a graphic novel or a comic book type effect. Uh, you've probably seen a couple of these kicking around um, on YouTube. This one is kind of different in as much that uh, I've got it down to a science using uh, three layers just about as many filters so uh, without further ado uh, let's get started here we go and actually go under layer uh, duplicate layer and this one we're gonna actually name as ink INK and we'll click OK to that and we want to make a copy every time we uh, copy a layer we want to make sure it's uh, from the background so uh, we'll select the background and we'll do this again, layer, duplicate layer, and this will color, uh, so we'll name as colors. Okay, so right now we've got the original background, we have ink, which was the first one we copied, then colors, which is the one we just copied. Uh, now what we want to do is we'll stay on the colors one and we're going to do a, a quick adjustment layer to the, lay, uh, to the levels. So we do that under image, adjustments, and then levels. And what we want to do with the levels is so that they are 60 and 235 and we'll leave the midtones uh, where they are at 1 okay the uh, next filter that we want to apply uh, filter artistic cutout Levels is 8, simplicity is 5, fidelity is 3. And we'll click OK to that. And uh, now what we want to do is I'm going to set the mode to luminosity. There we go. So we want to go under layer again, and we're going to duplicate this layer. So we didn't select the background, we actually want to duplicate this layer here. And we're going to call this halftone. Okay. And what we're going to be doing for the halftone is oh, we're going to go under filter pixelate color halftone and we want to set the max radius to 4 pixels um, I think by default it goes to 8 so you want to take that down to the minimum which is 4 and then you can leave the uh, all this other channel information at 108, 162, 90, and 45. Leave those all where they are. Don't change those. And we're going to click OK. And what we want to do now is we want to set this mode to color. So right now the colors has the mode of luminosity and the half tone has the mode of color. Now we're going to select the ink layer. So if we go under filter, other, and do a high pass, um, we want to set the radius to 4.4 pixels. 
and click OK. And basically what it does is it gives you this grayed out effect uh, to your color. But it gives you a very, very high definition on your edges. So you uh, you can see where I'm going to take this on the, uh, with this next filter that I'm going to do. Um, and that is actually on the threshold. So if we go under image adjustment and we actually want to do the thresholds so that's down here and for the threshold for the edges we want to go with uh, one two three which is just a little um, gives you more white than it does black but it, uh, it cleans up the lines quite a bit so now we have our ink, we have our halftone, we have our colors, and the magic step is the one I'm going to do right now, and that will be to set the mode on this layer to multiply, and the second I do that, you'll see uh, the end effect. And there it is. There's your cartoonized version of the uh, cowgirl and that's pretty much it